Hey gang, it's David again, back to you with yet another Adobe XD tutorial. And in this one, we are going to take a look at uh, not one, not even two, but at three tools, which are the zoom tool, uh, the eyedropper tool, and the hand tool. So if that's something that you're interested in, just keep watching. So these tools might not be something to use when you want to like, create something, but they definitely come in handy when you want to simply, you know, like easily operate your document. And of course, the eyedropper tool lets you like control the colors really, really uh, easily. So let's start with the zoom tool. There's actually a few techniques of zooming uh, in and zooming out. So I guess uh, the most, I guess the most intuitive would be to simply click on a part where that you want to zoom in on. So I'm just clicking right now. But if you hold on the Alt key or Option if you're on a Mac and then click, you can see that we are basically zooming out like that. But if you want to be more precise and if you want to zoom in on like a specific part of your design, you could simply just click and drag around a piece of your design to simply zoom uh, zoom in. I think that uh, it's worth mentioning that you know you don't really have to use the zoom tool to you know, easily zoom in or, or zoom out. You don't even have to like ever, ever touch it, but to be able to control the views of your document. So first of all, if I just hold down the control and then the space bar key, you can see that we are temporarily being, uh, well, we are temporarily or dynamically uh, turning on the, uh, the zoom tool. So now I can simply, you know, use, use it as I would use, as I would normally use uh, the zoom tool. And if I press and hold down the control, the space bar and the alt keys, I'm going to be able to simply you know, zoom out like that. And of course, if you're on a Mac, you would use the command and option keys to do the same thing. But it can get even easier than this if I have like any other tool active. So let's say the polygon tool. And if I just press and hold down the either the control or the, or the alt keys, and then I just start scrolling, you can see that I am simply zooming in and zooming out like that. And by the way, if you're interested in, uh, well, if you're interested about the percentage, like the level of the zoom, you can just take a look up here. This value tells you, you know, how much zoomed in or zoomed out you are on your document. And uh, of course, there are some nice little shortcuts that uh, allow you to, you know, quickly zoom in and, uh, and zoom out. So let's say that I would like to like zoom in to 100%. All I would have to do is uh, to press uh, control and then the, the, well, the one key basically on my keyboard. And of course, if you're on a Mac, you would do the command plus one. If I want to zoom to 200%, I would do control two. And uh, if I press and hold down, well, if I press the control plus uh, three, well, you might be thinking that I'm going to be simply, you know, like zooming, <laughs> increasing the zoom, uh, the zoom to 300%. But no, I, with that uh, technique, with that shortcut, you can simply quickly zoom in on a specific like selected uh, item. So if I now press Control 3, uh, as you can see, this guy right here is selected. I'm going to simply zoom in like really, really closely, uh, like on this, uh, on this icon. And if I want to go all the way back, I'm just simply going to press con control and then zero to see all the design assets that I have right here. And by the way, these assets are, you know, <laughs> are delivered to my to my students uh, who take uh, my class uh, on Adobe XD, to which uh, the link you will find in the description uh, below. So this is the zoom uh, tool. Now let's talk about uh, those tools that are not right here in our uh, in our tool uh, box, but of course they exist. And so first I'm talking about the hand tool. So if I press and hold down the space bar, you can see that I am dynamically initializing the space, well, the hand tool, which allows me to just you know, pan across my whole document space. So I'm pressing and holding down the space bar and then just clicking and dragging to simply you know, move my document uh, around. And last but not least is the eyedropper tool. Now, if you have something selected, you can see that, you know, they usually have like a fill and a border attributes to it. And you can click on these eyedropper icons to simply select uh, something, like pick up a, a color. But uh, if you don't want to do that, I mean, there's a quicker way uh, for that. And you can simply press the I key on your keyboard and you can see that this is you now quickly, quickly changing to the eyedropper tool. I mean, 
So there you go. This is how you can use uh, these like technical tools. So the zoom tool, uh, the eyedropper tool and the hand tool. I hope you liked this video. If you did, you know, definitely like, comment and uh, subscribe to the channel for more videos on graphic design and especially web design and web uh, development. So uh, as always, until next time, have a nice design.